Hey guys, welcome back. My name is AJ and today I'm gonna discuss about motion path. Motion path shows the ways of your object and bone over a series of frames and shows every point start to end. This line is path of the object indicate the direction of movement. Blue line towards future frames and black is toward the past frames. Each frame is displayed by a small white dots on the paths. The paths are automatically updated when you edit your keyframe and they are also active during animation playback. Let's work on bone with motion path. I have created this simple rig. Select this bone and I'm gonna move this rig from frame number 1 to 100. Add motion path on this bone. Change end number what you wanna add then calculate bone path. Now you can see path is showing the direction of bone. At 50 frame number change the direction of this bone. After change location path have automatically get the shape of bone direction. Create a pose like one leg forward and one leg back at frame number 1. Press Ctrl C to copy this and press Shift Ctrl V to paste pose flip on frame number 10. Duplicate this all bone and move this forward. Set last keyframe at 100 frame number. Somewhere up and down. Adjust it according to you. Now it's time to work on head. Rotate it the same flow of this path and like head is following overlapping action. Now calculate the motion path with this head bone. First is around frame. When you enable this button, you get path around the current frame after play animation. Second in range. Display path within specified range after play the animation doesn't change motion path. These are the start and end frame of the range in which motion paths are shown. The start frame is inclusive. So if you set start to 8, you will really see the frame 8 as a starting point of the path and set end to 80. Ending point of the path. Here is the calculate option. Actually calculate path creates a new motion path. This operator will update the path shape to the current animation as we did before. Recalculate all the visible motion path for object and bones. Press this cancel option to remove all created paths. Frame numbers. When enable this checkbox, a small number appears next to each frame dot on the path. Keyframes. Big orange square dots display on motion paths showing the keyframe of their bones. Keyframe numbers. You will see the number of the display keyframe. After enable, lines between the points are showing thickness with this change the thickness of motion paths. Custom color. Use color for this path line for this bone. We can add red color and for this and for this we can add green color. With this custom color we can easily recognize the bone of this path. Well I hope so. This animation video will be helpful for you. Thanks for watching. See you again soon. Bye.